Okay guys, Cheesy's back. Let's jump straight back in. Whoops. Don't know why that came up so loud. But apparently... There we go. Whoops. Apparently uh, that's going to set the tone for a really, really bad video. Come on! Better. Got to go through this rubbish again, though, unfortunately. I think I actually did mess the jump up. I just managed to correct it. I will save again just in case I die, just to show that it doesn't do any good. But I absolutely proed that, so let's hope I don't make any silly mistakes on the way down, which really would be stupid. And up we go, and down we go. And now we're here. To enter the palace of the guy, you must collect the six units, and I think if we wait here long enough, we'll see that I've collected the six units. So in we go. For awesome music. If you can't hear it very well, it's um, the moon from DuckTales game, which is a fantastic tune, one of my favourite uh, video game tunes out there. Now uh, for the cheap jeeps, you stand as close to the front as you can get and hope that you don't get screwed by the random number generator. Quite often you get crashes here, I'm not exactly sure why, I'll be right back. Right, let's try this again. I don't know if you can, you can get the glitch here as well. Might be useful, but not really, I don't think. Just stay as close to the front as you can, as I say. And hope that you don't get hit by so many that it ruins the run. Right, is there another save now? Yes, there is. That's good. Don't have to do that bit again. Oh, I didn't want to land on it. Why did it? Why was it not um, folded down there? No. I <sighs> didn't think I was going to land on that then. Oh, come on, stop screwing around with a hitbox on that cart. That should not happen. That is how you're supposed to do that. See, if you don't enter it at the bottom, it flings you downwards. So you can't tell me that's not how you're supposed to do it. That's, that was absolute crap. That is absolute bull crap. I've done this so many times and that has been the way that I've done it all the time. But now, because I'm recording, it's decided that's not going to be the way to do it. What the hell? Okay, right. We'll try something different this time then. See if that works. But I can bet you it won't. Oh, 
crap! I was through. Don't know if anyone noticed, but I did literally nothing differently this time. I still entered it exactly the same. Okay, I don't know why exactly I fell through the platform just then. But I did exactly the same as I had been. And what is up with that glitch where sometimes I'm walking off the edge of the platform and doing the, the jumps? That shouldn't be happening. But anyway. Yes, finally. Right, that's it now. Finish with this. I swear, every time I've done this, I I do that wall jump segment bit exactly the same. Just decided it wasn't going to work for me this time. Right, we did it! Zero kilometers remaining. And then more fantastic Mega Man 2 music. Do, 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 do. If you couldn't tell, this is the uh, boss from the first Wily Castle stage. This is the Mecha Dragon. He's uh, slightly different than you may remember him if you're a Mega Man fan. He's uh, had a bit of an upgrade. He's now the Dragon Devil. Any of you that have played the Mega Man games a lot will know the uh, the devil uh, type monsters. The yellow devil from 1 and 3. The green devil in 8. Uh, I think we've got uh, a block devil in 10. So it's a... Uh, it's that kind of boss. You got the the pattern that shows well it doesn't show you on this one, it's not always the same. All the devils and the Mega Man games, they were always followed the same pattern. This one not so much. This one follows a pattern all of its own. Well, it's the same every time within the boss, but not every every revolution. But after a couple of goes, you get used to what the patterns are after each phase, and off he flies. So you think you've chased him away, but no, he comes back. And you've got to be ready to run. And if you're not pretty quick off the mark, I wasn't especially quick, but I think I was quick enough. Just barely. He will catch you, and that will not be good, but he crashes into the wall, and away he goes, and then you can shoot him in the face as much as you like. Mega Man 2 success music. And here we are, we're at the entrance of the guy. What a terrible jump. What a terrible jump, honestly. What am I doing? This is another of those segments that I did quite a lot on the uh, very hard playthrough. There wasn't, they don't give you much in the way of saves, as you'd expect. That's not a good jump. That was very, very bad. There was that. That's bad. Yeah. Uh, I'm not quite sure why I got hit there. Ah, trigger, come on, thank you, stop mucking me about. This is absolutely terrible. That's more like it. There we go. Be a little bit careful here. And then carefully edge forwards. Because you don't want to be caught by that. 
here I believe you can actually cheat the game. If you keep restarting you can save jump over there. But I'm not going to be doing that. I'm going to be failing miserably. I didn't actually realise there was a block just there. I don't know if you can get on that. It would be quite helpful if you could. Well, that's alright anyway. And that guy comes out and throws a delicious fruit at you and you get across the other side and you save. Ah yeah. I messed up so much on this the last time I was playing through it. I thought I knew where I was going. Obviously I had no idea. I'm still not sure I know where I'm going, I'm not going to lie. I spend my life messing up this labyrinth. Yeah, I think this is okay so far. Yeah, that was actually the right way, I think. So, yeah, well, that's all right. This, hopefully this won't take too long. Well, I probably could have actually gone, man. That was pretty much perfect. That's fine. Yep. Good. Wait for the next one. Yes, I think we're there. Excellent. Fantastic stuff. I'm better than I thought. No, it's, it's not that bad when you you know where you're going. We can, oh, well, no we can't. I was going to say we can take a little shortcut, but apparently I'm unable to do that. There we go, that's the shortcut. And another save point. So we're doing quite well at the moment. I hope this keeps up. As you can see already, this is gonna this is basically breakout as I'm sure you all know. But you uh we're aiming to get to the top left, top right, sorry. Uh, so I'm going to try and keep it on that side without completely messing up the entire floor. Uh oh. This could be trouble. Ah, gee, this is not good. This is terrible. Oh. Uh oh. That is really, really not good. Uh, don't tell me this is stuck. Come on. Oh, but I am, so that's good. This is probably the worst this has ever gone. I only need one more block, but I've taken out so much of the floor, I've got no chance of really directing the delicious fruit over there. I've just got to hope. Well, it'll get it eventually, obviously, but 
Oh. I just can't believe how badly this has gone. This never goes this badly. Get up there quickly while we've got the chance. Get the Vic Viper out and die instantly and have to do all of that all over again. Isn't that absolutely fantastic? <sighs> well, this... Oh, come on. This will be the last attempt before I cut. I was hoping to get pretty much to end game before the end of this video, but that's not going to happen now. This isn't behaving particularly nicely. There we go. Now I just want to wait for this to come out of there. I can get up there nice and quickly. Into the big viper, and this time we're not going to make such a mess of it. Or are we? We might do. Nope, we didn't. Which is good. And we're here. So, we're not quite as far as I wanted to get, but it'll have to do. So, I'll see you guys next time for more I Want to Be the Guy.